everyone, I am the Dragon Skull, and welcome back to Resident Evil 8 Village. Where we left off, um, we didn't really do much plot-wise, all we did was explore most of the village, getting the last of the, um, hidden items that I, um, needed to get. And I did collect a lot of treasures as well, um, although something important did happen in the last episode. We discovered the source of all the mold, not only in this game, but in Resident Evil 7 as well. It was all... Turns out, underneath us, right, right now, is some kind of giant mold structure that's been, um... Um, that's been the source of everything since, since Resident Evil 7. And so, in this episode, we're definitely going to be heading down to Heisenberg now. He's the last lord we have to face. But before we do that, I need to, um, cook some food with the Duke here. Oh, good. I was just thinking of ways to pass the time. Now that I've got, um, the rare meat, I can, um, cook things. Like, I've got, um... I've only got... I do have one poultry, so I can make this now, which greatly increases my health. And I also have one fish, so I can make this, which increases my movement speed. And I need this. I want to be able to move faster, so... Let's do that. I can hardly wait. Just excuse me a moment. Yep, I cannot wait either. I like the sound effects of him cooking in the background. Finished. I'd love for you to enjoy as well. Sarmala de Pes. Mmm. Delicious. Duke, you know how to make a good mo uh, meal. Alright, now I can move a lot faster than I, I usually think do. such a dish could be had in this winterbound frontier. And I can also... Wait, can I? Oh wait, no, I've only got one poultry on me. Well... Mm -hmm. I'll just put it in for now, so once when I get back, I should be able to find another one. Hopefully. Hey, um, I also, um, I also still need, um, I need, well, I need one fish just for this. So I need one fish and one chicken left for this. And then I'll be, I'll have done all the meals. I've procured huh. some new items for you, Mr. Winters. Let's also sell some stuff while I'm here. Uh, not not this. I still need to find the other thing I need to combine it with. Mm, I don't have a use for this meat, so I could sell that. Ah! Hang on. Let me look. Let me look at um the other meals. No, I I don't think I need the meat, so I could sell that and and free up some inventory space. Might as well. Uh. Where's the... Ah, here is meat. And in case I need, I could just buy it back from him, right? I'm buying this because of our relationship, you know. Sure, it's not, and it's not because um, you... Um, Please do take a look at my new stock. Of course I will. It's definitely not because um, you, you want to eat some more food. Uh, you said you got new stock, but I don't see anything. Anything worth buying, at least. You still got my old guns, but I don't need that. And all my guns are currently upgraded. You lie. You said you had new new stuff, but you don't. I look forward to seeing the fruits of your exploration. Oh, and before I forget, I need to put the I forgot to put the flask that I currently have in here. Just so I don't have to hold on to it the whole time. The arms flask. So I'm guessing the last flask that we're going to be getting is the torso of uh, my of my baby Rose. And something else I need to remember I I forgot to um do before is read um my diary. It's been updating a lot and I keep forgetting to read through it. Uh Yeah, I've I've read this one and this one. So the next the newest one is the um, February 9th. Okay. February 9th afternoon the altar. Uh, as soon uh, so so Rose was divided into four flasks and given to the four lords Dimitrescu, Donna, Moreau, and Heisenberg. I can save Rose if I can get all four of those. I still don't trust this Duke, but he was but he was right about this th this one thing. Time to get my daughter back. February ninth, Mountain Garden. I saw Mia. I saw Mia in the fog. What is she doing here? No, she's gone. I have to accept that. But I guess a part of me still can't. 
Well, because she's your wife. Of course, um, you, 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 you struggle with accepting her loss. I still can't believe Mia died at the beginning of the game. Just, she was a major character in Resident Evil 7, and to see her just suddenly killed off like that, it's a risky move on the developer's part. Okay, Bene House Beneviento. Those walking nightmares I was having in that house was all the work of Donna, but I admit, I am still worried about the, uh, the thing that Mia wouldn't tell me before, and now I'll n never know what it was. Only two flasks left. I swear I'll, uh, I'll at least save Rose. Caves. Um, I finally got hold of, of the third flask, but the exit was blocked by that asshole, Moreau. I need to find another way out. There's something else nagging me, though. He said something about Miranda w uh, wanting her baby back. I have a feeling he wasn't talking about Rose. Nope. Okay, lake. I ran into Chris and his goons in a shack by the lake. They seemed to be researching something. What are they up to? I had so many questions, but then that, that giant fish t t uh, turns out... How was Moreau attacked? I need to get out of here. But he said the exit was underwater. Moreau's hut. Moreau, oh, Moreau's belly up and up, and and I'm almost out of the lake. Then who, sh then who shows up? Uh, up by the by the last child, called Heisenberg. Not in person, of course. Through uh, through a dusty old TV. He told me the last flask is so is in some stronghold. I'm not going to let him have his way, but I don't have t uh, many other options right now. This better not be a trick. And that's it. That's all from the diary. So now we're going to head on down over to Heisenberg. And I am pretty sure I got everything in this area. There is something in the well underground that I missed. But I looked up what items I missed were in there. And it turns out all I missed was a bunch of, was a bunch of ammo. I know I could easily get uh, elsewhere. It wasn't anything valuable, and I am so glad that the um the, the other combinable ob or object with the necklace isn't among them. Also, something I um just realised until now is that it's 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 daylight now. When I began the game early, it was like early in the morning, like because it was all foggy. But now it's like in the afternoon. I like that, but um. I kind of liked it better when it was in the morning because all the all the grey clouds um made the atmosphere more scary. Okay, last time we went this way to um yeah, last time we went this way because there were treasures and secrets here, and I did get the ghost that was in there. Turns out it was under the house, not in in it where I was. So now we're gonna go this way and continue the story. Whoa! I hear lichens. Whoa! Is that? It's another castle. That's definitely not the factory. I think the factory is where I need to go later on. Hmm. Maybe um. Maybe I get the flask first and then go to the factory and fight Heisenberg. Oh god, that sounds like a lot of them. Oh god, they're right there. Uh, I'm just gonna take this, thank you. I mean, I don't know why I'm scared. I've got plenty of ammo. I can take these guys out. Wait, I thought I saw one of them hiding back there. Alright, let me snipe this guy. Alright, let's take him out. I need to I need to um spend some of this ammo anyway, so might as well um start shooting him. Oh. Where's the lay? Thank you. Whoa! Whoa, 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 whoa! Well, you might as well use this as well. Anyone else want some? Whoa! I didn't mean that literally. God, there's a lot of lichens in this area. 
Something tells me, oh god, they're using bows and arrows. That are on fire. Two can play this sniping game. Ow! I'm guessing the stronghold that I'm heading into is their nest. Like the nest of the lichens. Something tells me that I'm gonna be that um I'm gonna be fighting the um the massive lichen with the with the huge hammer, the one that I, that I encountered the, at the beginning of the game. You guys remember which monster I'm talking about? The one with the that looks like a giant werewolf Santa Claus. <coughs> Something tells me I'm gonna be I'm gonna fight him once I go in there, and this time I'm not gonna run away like a coward. Hang on. Let me see how fast I can run. I do kind of feel a bit faster. It's not too fast, like uh, with that meal I had, but it's some. It's an. It's a bit of an improvement, I guess. Like it's. It's a bit of an improvement that it doesn't feel like I wasted so much of uh, food just to get just to make it. Also, what's that sound? I hear a whistling sound. There's a there's an explody barrel there, but I'm not gonna shoot that yet unless a bunch of lichens show up. Maybe I should have used this it on on the ones I just killed earlier. Hopefully, more will show up so I can just blow them up. Ooh, treasure chest, treasure under the stronghold. Oh yeah, I forgot about that. Where is it? Uh, that's not it. Uh, it's some way here. Well, it's not in this area, but I think it's underneath. Like it says under the stronghold, so I need to go underground to to find it. Hopefully, I'll um find a way down there soon. Uh -oh. Lichens. Okay, now's a good time to shoot the barrel. Nice. Took out a lot of them. Okay, the, oh, I see you up there. All right, let me get my, let me snipe him. Got you right in the leg. God, I love the sniper rifle. It's so much fun to use. Grab all the money I can get because I'm gonna need I'm gonna need a, I'm, I'm gonna be buying a lot of things from the Duke. I'm guessing. How much inventory space do I have? Quite not a lot. Maybe I should organize my inventory more. Hang on, let me do that real quick. Uh, move the lock picks down here and move this there. Uh, put these up here as well. Hmm. This should be alright, I guess. Hang on, put this there, and this here. There we go. No, that doesn't look right. I'll just stick it down here. Kind of annoying that a lot of them, um, that some things take up two spaces and the lockpicks only t take like one space. Why can't the um, the first aid med take up like one s slot as well? I don't see any um, more coins on the ground. I'm assuming I picked them all up, but I don't see any more. That's why I hate about killing a lot of enemies at once. I can't keep track of all the items they drop. There's another barrel here. I'm going to leave that alone until the more light can show up. <laughs> I've got a lot of money. And I'm only calling it... Door open. No idea, Ethan. Maybe we need to use the crank, maybe? Oh. Ah, there's a lever up here. We can um, pull that. <laughs> 
God, I'm I'm getting a lot of money. I am gonna be rich in this village at least, because I think I'm guessing only the village can take this type of currency. And by village, I mean the duke, since he's the only one you can. Who, who has a who, who still has a business in this village? I feel like there's gonna there's more to the Duke than um, the game has previously led on, but I don't know what exactly. Like, I feel like he's gonna be like a secret boss or something, or a secret villain, or maybe a secret fifth lord. That'd be cool. Ooh, like it. That's it. A little closer. Boom. <laughs> More of them are coming. Come on, come this way. Come on, come on. Oh, they're smart. They're, they're, they're at ease. Or maybe not. Just blowing them all to smithereens. Oh, I see you over there. Oh, there's a lot of them. Oh, sh shot his head off just as he was about to come over here. Oh, is that all of you? I'm guessing that is. Hang on, there was more lay. Oh, hello. Goodbye. Getting a lot of stuff. A lot of money and a lot of crystal skulls. Even though this isn't the kingdom of the crystal skull. There's also some items over there though, but I don't know how I'm going to reach those because... It's out of my reach. Wait, they're not there. They probably despawned. What is that sound? Oh, there's a bunch of crows around uh, above me. Maybe they're the ones making those noises. Any more bags of coins? Nope, I don't see any. Alright, let's climb the ladder and move on. Don't want to waste too much time in this one area. I want to progress the story. I want to uh, see what happens next. Oh god, maybe I shouldn't have wasted all those explody barrels because more lichens are probably going to show up now. Eh, it doesn't matter. If they show up, I could just, um, I'm sh I just, I could just kill them the old fashioned way. With a bunch of bullets. Nope, I don't see any more coins, so. Onwards! Oh, the gate scared me. Stupid gate. I am definitely going to come back for this, but it's underneath the stronghold, and up so I need to wait until I'm underground, and then find a way to go backwards. I will get it, guys, don't you worry. And hopefully I'll encounter the last fish and poultry I need aid in this area. Those are some really heavy doors, but they're nothing compared to the gates of Mordor. Got a lot of scrap and everything, but I don't, I don't feel like, I don't really need to craft any bullets or anything because I've got a lot of um, bullets as it is. And uh, hang on, how am I? I'm doing. I've got five mines. Well, six actually, because I got one up here too. Uh, how am I doing on pipe bombs? I've only got one. Huh. All right, might as well make some more then. There we go. Save up on the ammo. I've only got two explosive rounds for the grenade launcher, though, and two flashbangs. Hang on. Yeah, these are all flashbangs, but I don't really have a use for them because all they do is blind enemies. They might come in handy in the boss fight later on with the um the giant Santa werewolf, but that's pretty much it. Okay, save here in case I happen to die. 
All right, let's go. Let's head on inside. I'm going inside the werewolf den. Maybe I might encounter one of those beasts again, the um, the actual werewolves, as well as lichens. I definitely know that th that this is where the um, the hammer wielding Santa werewolf is going to be. Yeah, I wonder what gave that away, Ethan. The fact that there are tons of lichens around, or the fact that um, someone set up a bunch of explosive barrels specifically to deal with said lichens. Oh god, there's a lot of them. God, there's so many! You think I've got a lot of bullets? Okay, I'm gonna jump down here now. Lure him down, then shoot the barrel. Come on, Lycans, come and get me! Ooh, shotgun ammo, I'll take that. And I'll take all your collectibles while you're down here. Oh, those are regular barrels. Ooh, got more pipe bombs. Alright, use this now. Need to spa sparse out my ammo so I can save up more inventory space. There's definitely more of them in here. Oh, hello. And whoa! Never mind. You can go first and then you. This is fun. I feel really overpowered with all the upgrades I've gotten for my guns. Whoa! Jeez, oh, you scared me. Screw you. I see you hiding back there. Well, you're dead now. All right, switch back to the to the M19. Any more? I think just they keep coming. Maybe I'm not supposed to kill them all. Maybe I'm supposed to keep on keep moving. Oh, jeez! Ah, get off! You've already taken two of my fingers. What more do you want? Alright, how do I get out of this hole? I probably should have jumped down. Oh, never mind, I got them all. Music's calming down. Ah, there, there's stairs here. Didn't see that the first time. There are still more lichens, but I think I've killed all the ones in this area. Oh, never mind, there's more. Alright, let me get some distance. Wait, 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 hang on, hang on. Oh, I need help. I didn't realise. And let's equip this. And then switch, use the flashbangs. No, 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 no. This is not what I wanted, but who cares? Just shoot them. Oh, God, I, I think I've cornered myself. Whoa, I thought you were dead. Okay, you, you're dead now. Whew. Oh, this is a zip wire thing. I didn't even notice that. Yeah, I think they're just going to keep coming, no matter how many I kill. So I probably should um, move it. I should be like King Julian and move it, move it. What am I doing on items now? Um, I've definitely spent a lot of ammo. Which is a good thing, because I need some um, inventory space. Uh, how am I doing on health? I'm doing good. Yeah. Oh, all good. Alright. Grab on. 
Everything's quiet so far. Let me get the grenade launcher out. Actually, I, mean, I want to put it in so in my shortcut since I'm since I keep um like take out the knife and let's switch to the um the flashbangs. I need to use some of these so I can um where uh, where are they? I'm just gonna use some of my flashbangs so that they don't so I don't have too many of them. I should probably save some of them for the big boss as well. Nice, he jumped right into the bullet. What an idiot. Okay, big guy. Big guy? Uh oh. Okay, mines, mines, mines. I need to use my mines. Because there's a lot of them right there. Oh god, he's still not he's not down yet. Perfect crystal skull. Thank you. I'll take that. God, this is probably the most lichens I've ever killed in, in one video. I feel like a badass um, killing all those um, supposed werewolves like it was nothing. It's because Ethan's been through so much in the previous game, he's used to this by now. And nothing's going to get in the way of him finding his daughter. Okay, I got all the items here. Wait, wait, what about the lower levels? I didn't check the lower. Oh, th I missed something back at the save point. All right, I'm gonna head. I'm gonna go back. To, well, I'm not gonna jump down there because I'll, I'll probably fall. To, I'll break my legs. If Ethan does break his legs, though, he can always just um and put um. He can always just put some um, goop juice on, over them to heal himself. Like he'd just be like, <laughs> oh, my legs are magically healed now. Okay, I got all the items down here. Oh wait, it's not here. It's up. It's up there. Hang on. Let, where's the way back to the save point again? This way. Okay. I'm gonna go back and get whatever's there. So I'll see. And I'll see you guys when I. Oh, where'd you come from? That's cheating. Sneaking up on me like that. Did you have your legs on silent or something? Alright, let's look around for whatever item is missing in here. Aha! I, I see it! I see a little twinkle. Vivianite. Nice. Okay, that, that's everything in this area. Alright, let's head on back. Alright, we're back, guys. Um, but getting the the um, speed upgrade definitely was um, a, a good move on my part because <laughs> I got back here in, in like less time than I usually do whenever I'm trying to get from place to place got more magnum ammo I'm, I'm saving the magnum for the big bosses if I do run into the um the giant werewolf hammer wielding Santa Claus again I'm gonna run I'm not gonna use the magnum I'm gonna save that for Heisenberg no, wait, I, sh I should probably save it for Mother Miranda. Okay, got everything in this room. This th we're going underground now, so um, I need to keep an eye out for that treasure. Oh, hang on. Something here? No. Well, might as well reload this. So I can be ready to blind someone whenever I come down. Oh, it was just scrap. Okay. And we got another box here. I'm glad that, there's just, that the game just gives me a button I can smash boxes with, with the knife so I don't have to keep switching to the knife. Ooh, goat. 
<laughs> I like how the music just stopped as soon as I shot the goat. Ooh, I do not like that those sounds. Whoa. That is gross and scary. They're just hanging off dead bodies and eating them. Ooh. They didn't see me, but they know I'm here, so... The King's orders finally arrived. Withdraw. It is the most vexing... It is most vexing that we must abandon the border stronghold to those her heretics. If I, if I had but a little more time, I know I might be able to turn the tides of this battle. Nay, I sh nay, I should not... I should not put on airs. It is my curiosity that, that ties me to this place. There are a number of ruins in the vicinity which the locals say are very ancient. The ceremony sides with four giant statues, the caves with murals carved on the walls, the stone plinth they, they call the giant's chalice. Where's, where did the people who built them come from? Where did they go? Where did they come from, Cotton Eye Joe? <laughs> it irks me either we must abandon this place without knowing. Oh, you're giving me a lot of stuff, game. Yeah, the, the, the game's definitely preparing me for the, the fight with the, um, the, the werewolf Santa. Alright, game, I'm prepared. I've got tons of ammo, tons of grenades, tons of bombs and mines. I can take this thing. I know I can. Fight will probably be over a lot uh, before, before I even say before I even say Rose. Yeah, this definitely looks like an a, an arena like area. So as soon as I jump down, he's probably gonna show up. <sighs> yep, there he is. I told you. That's not good. Get blinded, just you, you overgrown Santa Claus. Alright, now let's switch to the, the, the flame ammo. The flame rounds. Ow! Oh god, his armor's right next to me. Alright, let's take this thing down. I'm not running away from you this time. This time I'm, I'm finishing you right here and now. Let's place down a couple mines. And place one here too. Get pipe bombs ready. Come on then. Oh, he's up there now. God, his war is terrifying. Oh, he's got—he's calling back on. Come on down then. I got—I got something, something to show you. Oh, not you. Ah, why aren't the mines going off? Come on, it's right there! There we go. He's still not down yet. Yikes! God, he's so terrifying. It's definitely going to take a lot to kill this guy. Right, place the oh, heal first. Ooh, just in time, because he was about to bring the hammer down on me. Maybe he used to be MC Hammer before um, he became this thing. Yet? Yes, I got him. He's done. Eat shit. I was about to say something similar. I was about to say rest in pieces. And my god, that is a lot of crystal. Crystal hammer. Oh, still got my mine. That was fun. That was a cool battle, actually. 
and it did last longer than I thought it would, so that's a good thing. Alright, let's go get the um all the items scattered about that I was too distracted with fighting him to not notice. Okay, that's everything. And the way out is through here. Hang on, what about the treasure? Is there is there a secret way here that leads to the treasure? No, okay. So I'm assuming going through here is going to lead me straight to the treasure. I'm not leaving without it. Whoa. Oh, that is beautiful. And there's so many crystals here. There's tons of shines as well, so there's dozens of crystal fragments I can get here. Alright, let's let's start mining for crystals. Crystal fragment, vi more Vivianite, crystal fragment, yellow quartz, okay, I'll take that. And another crystal fragment. Okay, there's still more crystals in here, though. There's tons of them. I should just rip out one of the big shards and sell that for a high price. I'd definitely make a mint with that. It's This one's... Oh, I see it. This one is kind of hard because, um... Well, the many crystals I can get here all blend together. But we got all the crystals. This is a really beautiful cave. I've actually been in a cave once that had crystals just like this one. Like when one time when I was going caving with um my um my my count my col my college, I, I almost said council for some reason. And then there was this one area that everyone was too afraid to go to, so me and one of my friends went in there instead. It was like a really tight squeeze, and it was pretty scary because part of me was scared that the whole thing was going to come down on me as I was crawling through. Ah, uh, there's the last flask. TV's probably going to come on as soon as I take it. The torso flask. I knew it. I knew it was my daughter's torso. This again. What? We've only seen a vision for the... You're the real deal, Ethan. Well Heisenberg. Done. Quit hiding, asshole. I'm not letting you get out of this. <laughs> cool your jets. Just a little bit more, and you're all wrapped up. I'll lend you a hand. So in exchange... In exchange what? First of all, come to me. Put all the flasks in the altar, and I'm sure you'll figure the rest out. See you, Ethan. God damn it. Okay. So Heisenberg just decided to leave his flask here for me to get. He wants me to come to the altar. Maybe if I put them all together, that'll lead to his factory instead. Okay, the treasure is in the direction of the exit, so let's go down here. But as I was saying, when I was in college, my first year, we all went on a trip somewhere. I don't remember where it was exactly, but it was—it had a lot, a, like a huge mountain area. Wait, is this the treasure? Jugli Mia Elmo's plate. I don't know if I ha how to pronounce that name. Yeah, this was the treasure. Okay. I was hoping it'd be something else, but it's fine. Ah, we got a boat. Alright, that's our way out. And, um, wh one day we went to a we went inside a bunch of caves to, and, uh, to explore, and it was really dark, and there was like a, a small crevice that, that um, is only big enough for someone to crawl in on their bellies through. Everyone else was too scared to go through there, except for me and one of my friends. So we decided to go in there with a teacher. And when, when we reached the other side, we found a whole area full of crystals. True story. I, I mean, it was beautiful. Like, really beautiful. I even took some of the crystals home with me as souvenirs. And if you guys still don't believe me, I've got proof. I actually have the crystals with me right now. Like, hang on a second, let me, um, get them. They're, they're in this bag. See? 
Here's here's the proof right here. Beautiful, isn't it? It's exactly like the crystal fragments I've I've been collecting in this game. I love crystals. They're one of my favorite things in the whole world. It's it's mostly what, why I love Steven Universe because it, it's a show all about crystal gems. Hmm. Where's this lead to? Ooh, an, a, a dungeon area with items to get. I, I think I'll save my game once I get back to um, the altar, so I uh, so I can put the last flask in. Okay, got chem fluid. A, a photo, photo of a phantom fish. I already got this one though. I already got that fish, so I don't have to um, worry about going back for it. Kado implantation notes, subjects 174 to 181. Subject 174, Mihai M. Characteristics 21, male sil silversmith, if it's scar scars from pen Panomia. I don't know if, if I pronounced that right. Results, low affinity, Kado failed to grow, Bod body transformation, drop in cognition, another lichen, sent to pasture. Subject 177, um, Bernadette B. Characteristics 21, female, no occupation, no history of illness. Results, death. Subjects 181, Al Alcina D. Alcina Dimitrescu. Alcina was Dimitrescu's first name. Characteristics 44, she was 44? I thought she was younger than that. Yeah, 44 female, noble descendant, not from the village, hereditary blood disease. Results, very high affinity, no loss of cognition, arbit arbitrarily able to control body transformation, applied cognition control procedure, sent for observation. Ah, so these are like uh, experiments of the, um, of the Kado and the mold. And, um, most test subjects died and, uh, uh, well, most of the, test of the test subjects either died or became lichens, while um, Dimitrescu was a um, was a success and became a um, and became the the really tall vampire lady she is now. It didn't say anything about the other three the other three lords though. I'm hoping later on, maybe if we go to Mother Miranda's lab or something, we'll um, learn more about the Four Lords and their abilities, and how um, science can explain the supernatural elements to them. Did I grab it then? Yeah, I think I did. Alright, let's get out of this place. We're going to head on back to the altar now. We're not going to put the last flask in just yet, because... Um, I have a feeling doing that is going to result in me getting closer to the end of the game. And I just want to get over there and save for now. We definitely did do a lot in this episode though, which I am happy for. Okay, unlock, and we're out. Ooh, there's chickens! Yes, poultry! Oh, I, I put my gun on my knife away though, so I'm just going to have to shoot them. Alright, you know what, just equip the knife. I don't want to waste the bullets. Come here, you. I need your meat. And you, come on. Stay still. There we go. I hate chasing chickens around. But hopefully this, this will be the last time I have to do that. 470 coins, nice. Alright, that... Ooh, there's um, something here that I didn't get before. I should definitely check this out. I also need one more fish to make the last meal. Goat. Nice. The only bird cages I can shoot down? No, does not appear so. Ah, we're back here again. We're back at the church. Oh wait, I could have come here this whole time because I had the iron insignia key. Oh, I'm dumb. 
I didn't realize. I could have gotten the meal this whole time. Okay. We still need fish though. Where, where have I been that I haven't gotten fish yet? Uh, I got the fish here, didn't I? What about Moreau? Um, did I get all the fish where Moreau lives? If I miss some fish, then I could just go back and get it in my spare time, rather than um, go there while recording. Because I need one more fish. And... Oh, I got this well, okay. Alright, before we head to the altar, there's um, some... There's, we didn't explore this part yet, so let's go ahead and check what's over there. I don't recall um, that part of the map being red before, though. I, I was... I thought for certain I did get everything. But apparently not. Oh, is that it? That was it? Just sh scrap and shotgun ammo? No fish? Damn it, game. I could have used some fish. Heard us about it, though. Okay, now we've completed the whole village. We've searched everything. We got everything. I still need to find a in one more fish, though. There's one here, but it's already crossed out, so I got all the fish there. And I definitely got all the treasures. Cave Church. Um, I think I've been there. The Castle de Matres, got everything there. Uh, got this, got that. Got everything at House Beneviento. And Moreau. Yeah, I got everything here as well. Where do I get the last fish then? I'll probably look it up in a walkthrough or something. But anyway, let's head back to the altar and um, do what we need to do. Uh, where's the way out? Th this way. I'm blind. This has been a good run though. I'm really happy with how it, how it went. Maybe if I'm lucky I can buy some fish from the Duke. I did sell him some meat, but it's not fish. That's not the way to the altar. The altar is this way. I think we're nearing the end of the game now, guys. Um we got the last flask and we can put it in we just need to put it in it's there. It's my now. greatest pleasure to see you return alive. Indeed it is. Alright, before we end the episode, let's go to talk with the Duke and sell some things. Let's sell all these crystal fragments and the large crystal, the Vivianite, the yellow quartz, the nine crystal skulls, and the perfect crystal skull, the crystal hammer, not this, I still haven't found the item I need to combine with this yet, and sell the plate. Wait, can the plate be combined with something? It, I will. Hang on, let me check the plate. I look forward to seeing the fruits of your as you wish. Okay, so I, it can't be combined. All right, sell the plate then. Uh, still got nothing new here. Pay me no mind. Nothing here. All right, let's go cook some things. Okay, I got the last poultry now, so now I can make the two cheap two row de pu de pui. We've gathered all the ingredients. This one increases ah. my health a lot, so I could definitely use this. Finished. I'd love for you to enjoy as well. Thank you very much, Chief. Hmm. You've done it again. Now my health has greatly increased. To think such a dish could be had in this winterbound frontier. All that's left is, is this, and then I've got I've cooked all the meals. But I need one fish. Just one. Oh, where am I gonna get it though? Do you have fish in here? Please? No. And he doesn't have the meat I sold him either. He probably ate it already. The fat bastard. This is all an investment. It's sure to be a good meal. Indeed. Alright, hang on, let's check my journal, see if there's been any new entries. Ah, here we go. 
I finally have all four flasks, but Heisenberg said I needed to do one more thing to heal her. Take all the flasks to the altar. Will this really heal her? Can I trust Heisenberg? No, you can't, Ethan. Cooking, uh... This is just showing all the, the meals I've had. And tips, uh... Nothing about the fish. So let's just save. And we're done. Okay guys, we're going to be ending this episode right here. I think we're nearing the end of the game now. I feel like there's still a lot, a couple more episodes to go, but we're definitely nearing the end now. We've um, gotten all four flasks, and I just need to put the last one in the altar. I'm not doing it now, because I want to do it at the start of the next episode. Um, I'm st I'm st I still need to find one more fish to cook the last meal, so I'm going to explore the game on my own, like go to all the areas I've been to, Make sure I got all the fish, and um, once I do, I'll um, cook the last meal before I leave. Okay, um, next episode, we're definitely going to be encountering Heisenberg. I thought we were going to see him in this one, but it turns out all we did was fight the um, the giant werewolf Santa. But um, that's fine. We, we did get a cool boss fight out of it, so I am glad we did that. And now that he's out of the way, we can just focus on Heisenberg. So next episode, we're definitely going to his factory, and then after we, we defeat him, we're going to be facing Mother Miranda and getting our daughter back. We still don't know what, what Chris has to do with all this, though. Like, we know he... We do know that there's some kind of um, giant mold structure controlling it all, and Miranda probably has control over that. Maybe Miranda is another Evelyn. That That's a good theory. Maybe Evelyn was never the true controller, she's just like a, a fraction of Miranda. Like, what if, Mar hear me out on this, what if Evelyn was a clone of Miranda who has the same, same powers to control the mold like Miranda does, but m she doesn't have full control, like she doesn't, she makes her people who are infected by the mold submissive, but, uh, but there's a side effect that makes them crazy, like with the Baker family, while Miranda, the four lords that serve her, they're completely loyal to her, and, um, well, to some degree, at least. Um, I remember um, in the beginning, Dimitrescu um, was was um, against um, her when um, when she said that the ceremony was more important because she was all like, "Hell with the ceremony! I'm gonna kill Ethan for killing my daughters." So she doesn't have complete control over the lords. They still have free will of some kind. I don't know. Hopefully, the next episode will answer some questions. I still don't know what. Is Chris going to become a werewolf or something? Because I, I, I thought for certain that the giant werewolf Santa uh, hammer wielding guy is was Chris. But since he's dead now, that cancels out my theory. And I doubt Chris is dead because, well, Chris is a very vital character in the Resident Evil series. There's no way they just kill him off without us knowing. It's a really gut gutsy move. Just like how killing Mia off in the very beginning was a gutsy move on their part. But it works. It, it it acts as motivation for um, Ethan to try and get his um, um daughter back. We'll find out soon. But in the meantime, thank you guys so much for watching this video. If you liked it, please leave a like and, su and subscribe to my channel for more videos. And I will see you all next time. Peace.